Abba God, thank you. Thank you for granting us more strength today than we had yesterday. We believe that you are making our pathway straight. And we know you will order our steps as we journey throughout this day. For your word declares that you are the way, the truth, and the light. So we ask that you light up the dark places in our minds. Bring truth to destroy every lying, intrusive thought and guide us through every endeavor. Father, make your word plain to us today and allow our hearts to truly comprehend your written and spoken word. Bestow on us the creativity and the gumption to conceptualize and implement the words and promises you have resounded inside of our spirit. Retract the hand of the enemy from our lives. In this moment, we extend our shield of faith that is your son, Jesus Christ, to divert every fiery dart of doubt, shame, and deceit. We commit today to learn your word and come into agreement with your promises. God, we bless you. We honor you. We exalt you above all of our circumstances, above all of our hardship. Father, we ask that you build up in us a new level of strength and a new level of courage. Joshua 1 and 9 tells us to be strong and courageous. So Father, help us to be strong in ourselves. Help us not be wavering. Help us, God, hold on to you when everything else around us is topsy-turvy and chaotic. Father, Help us be courageous. Help us be brave. Help us be confident in knowing that you will grant us victory after every fight, after every test, after every encounter with people. God, be in us and be with us. Deuteronomy 31 and 8 says, Do not be afraid or discouraged, for the Lord will personally go ahead of you. He will be with you. He will never fail you or abandon you. God, we are reassured in this moment that you will never leave or forsake us. And though all those people and those we loved and looked to for support may have hurt us in the past, you will never do that. So knowing you will never abandon us, God, we simply say we trust you and we know you are here with us and in us. In Jesus' name, we 